Okay, you guys, today I'm going to teach you guys how to SSH into your 2.2.1 uh, or 3.0 iPod Touch 1st gen, 2nd gen, or iPhone 3G or iPhone. First, go to the link in the description. It should take you to this website called Soft82. Okay, and then download the newest version of WinSCP. Just click download, and once it's done, exit out. And you should have this new icon on your desktop called WinSCP. Run it. Allow. English. Next. Next. Put typical. Next. And put Norden. Next. Okay, once it's done, you should say launch. Okay, finish, launch it. And the next step you gotta do it on your iPod or iPhone. Okay, go into Cydia, which I've already done. And then uh, click search. And then type in SSH. And then click search. And you should see one that's called automatic SSH and toggle. Install toggle first. Install. Confirm. Reloading data. Return to Cydia. Now go back to packages. Now install automatic SSH. Install. Confirm. Once it's done, just say reload. Okay. After this, I think you're done installing it. You can exit out. Okay, and now you should have a new icon. Toggle it. You see a little fish? Click on it. And click enable. And you're done. And then the next step, go into settings. click your network and then you see this little blue arrow click on it and uh, I think like it's like towards like where you see six axis it says your IP address and all the other info get your IP address write it down I'm gonna get mine and the next step go back on your computer and your and you should see a page like this uh, your username is root r o o t and your password is Alpine. Okay, and this is your IP address. I'm gonna type in mine. Oh, I messed up. Damn. Okay. Okay, once it's done, you should have your IP address and all that other stuff. Click save and and save password. Click save password. And I'm just gonna type in iPhone. Okay, and you should have it right there. Click login and make sure your iPod's on. And it should say this. You should have this error. Click in yes. This is just to see if it works. Click yes and it should say. And there you go. We just SSH into your iPhone or iPod. Okay, guys. Peace. Hope this helped.